get myself a lovely book. So we're going to be doing this one. And it's also a cleanser, upper cleanser. All right. So what I'm going to do, first thing, let's wash off these two upper. All right. That's the first thing I want to do. Now, so the reason why I'm going to be doing the recipe because, you know, you got aloe vera cleanser. So instead of we're going to use aloe vera, we're going to be using green apple. All right. We got aloe vera cleanser. And instead of we use the aloe vera because I don't have any aloe vera now. So I'm going to be using green apple to do the cleanser today. But I'm going to show you how to do this one. And it's simple. So if you're at home, this is what you can do. You get yourself the apple and put it straight into your blender like this. That's the first apple right there. All right, the green apple. We're gonna get the next one. Lovely. So, so that's two medium size green apple. All right. Now, what I'm gonna do? I'm going to get half of a lemon. All right. And squeeze that lemon juice into it. fresh ginger and we're gonna put some ginger in it all right no ginger in the house all right and ginger is very good for help to reduce you know what i mean inflammation and also the cholesterol level very very important with the ginger but this drink is a good good cleanser for the body so if you're a person who are interested enough in doing a cleanser and you're saying to yourself wow this is what i want to love to do today so if you have green apple in your kitchen right now and you feel like oh i feel a little bit tired and stressed out and all them sort of stuff that these are things you want to do because sometimes the body needs certain things which we're not giving it we need to nurse our body just like how you nurse a baby at home. You need to nurse the immune system with some natural ingredients like what I'm using right here. So we're going to add some water. All right. 
it's not i don't use the bigger blenders i should have used the bigger one yeah all right and it says over here like a trouble in the night <laughs> big up yourself because i was keep talking on on my instagram and they say oh chef ricotta you need to make it so i say okay i'm gonna go and make it then all right so this is what you need to do and it's a very simple recipe now you can add parsley to it if you like parsley you can add some fresh mint if you like some fresh mint or if you want to just keep it simple like me i keep things simple because when you start to do things complicated then your you know i mean your viewers are gonna be like ah oh, i can't be bothered with that i don't have this i don't have that so you want to keep it simple ginger and lemon is popular and the green apple all right don't say oh it's man-made this and that and blah it got seeds in it okay guys a good vibe so let's blend this stuff So that's what it look now you might have said how long should i drink this you know what i mean how long should i drink this that's the question all right now this one for me personally i would drink it for a week and see that's it. these are recipes i did before many times and it's a popular recipe on youtube you don't have to strain it you don't have to strain it if you remove the skin from the ginger and you wash off your apple in a real and proper way then you can consume in the bits in it because the bits in it is very good but look at my blend, my strainer So this is a strainer we got at least five percent of this coming into this so you want to use a bigger strainer where the gap them inside of the strainer will be a little bit bigger so some of the fiber fiber can go through anything you strain is light and refreshing and nice and if you even see flour it is light and it bake better anything you're doing Now, the reason why I don't use a juicer, okay, I could use a juicer, you know what I mean? But this is better than a juicer, guys. Trust me. Blend it, run it through a strainer, it's better than a juicer because the juicer is going to bring out the juice, and sometimes the juice is a little bit warm. So look at this, see? this so this is what you want to do all right so you want to make sure you're squeezing out it like this so that's why i like to use my strainer because this can go down to about this if i want by simple like i'm pressing it out okay so this is what you guys need to do at home especially if you want to make it for two days a large portion keep it in your fridge for two days don't make it for three days two days you know what i mean yeah so i can keep doing it like this and it does keep going through my strainer but it is gonna be better and light all right so you can see it for yourself so look at that and this right here if you got the right property, you can also um, dry it, press it, dry it, blend it up and use it for tea also. So there's a lot of stuff you can do at home, but we don't have to go in here with those things. Lovely. But look at that. But some of it come into this. All right, so it's like a cleanser for your body. So oh, this way you wanna consume in this a lot for five days. It's gonna make you, honestly, 
if you put um, this thing inside of it, what do you call it? Um, aloe vera, very good. Yeah. So here it is. All right. Very, very simple. Ginger, lemon, and green apple. Very good. It's like a cleanser for the body. All right. Consuming this for five working days. And see how that works on your body. If you feel good and you feel light, you go to the toilet, get out all of that thing inside of you, and just you feel light and free. And that's why a lot of people might have said, Why should I call you? But because I know I've been consuming a lot of healthy stuff in my immune system, so it keeps me light and free and relaxing, make you sleep good. You know what I mean? If you even Sit up for a couple of hours in the night till 12, 1 o'clock. If you go to bed to sleep, you will sleep good. So when you're, when you're, when you're eating certain kind of food and you're eating right and you're sleeping, you know what I mean, and you're doing things right, you will sleep really good. Aloe vera drink is also very good. Yeah, very, very good drink, aloe vera. Let's taste this one. Very nice. And you can taste the ginger. And also you can taste the opera says so a very good drink and i will encourage you guys to do this one for five working days and you will see some good result so inside of it you can see it got some of those fiber inside of it because i can taste it inside of my tongue in my back of my throat going down to going down to my tummy beautiful Mm. And as I say, you don't have to remove the skin from the apple. Yes. <laughs> Ginger and aloe vera is very good too. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Big up yourself, Chef Andre. Yeah, man, I good vibes. Yeah. Mm, beautiful drink. I can't complain. <laughs> yeah. Can't complain, guys. It's a beautiful drink. Mm. 